Right, good afternoon everyone, or good evening. Thank you all for coming. I'd like to open with some thank yous. And my first thank you is to Charlotte Clark. Charlotte, back in the day, was a PT client of mine at the gym. And she asked one day, can I bring my mate Polly along? I was like, yeah, of course, no problem. Shook the world, that decision, didn't it? <laughs> a little bit. Polly walked through the door to the gym. My eyes fell out my face and I was instantly smitten. She's the most beautiful, kind, loving and thoughtful girl I've ever met. Not only become my best friend, but my inspiration to grow and be a better man, son, brother, father and friend. She's my biggest fan, supporting and encouraging me in all I do, both on a business level and with my weird obsession of bodybuilding. And there's not a moment goes by where I can't ring her to run something by her, ask her advice or check if I'm being a dickhead. And trust me, she doesn't hesitate to let me know when I'm being a dickhead. <laughs> Polly, I don't say this enough, but I want to take this opportunity to say how proud I am of you, of your career and how tirelessly you work and the mum you are to our beautiful children. And obviously of uh, the partner you are to me. You're beautiful both on the inside and out. And um, thank you for what you've done for me and for what you've done today. If meeting you wasn't enough, you've also brought two sons to me, Archie and Alfie. They very quickly became a part, massive part of mine and my daughter Rose's life. And I'm now blessed with the best little family. Melts me to see how well the kids get on and the fun they have when they're together. And I look forward to the years of good times we have ahead of us. Ladies and gentlemen, please be upstanding. I'd like a toast to my wife, my Polly. To close my speech, I'd like to raise a, another toast to a man I unfortunately never got the chance to meet, and that's Polly's dad. I've heard so much about him since I've been around, and I know that he was truly loved and is now dearly missed. Terry, today I made your little princess my queen. I love her to pieces, and I promise to spend the rest of my life looking after her. We'll have a drink together one day when it's time. So I've always looked up to Cliff, not a joke. <laughs> so whatever he puts his mind to, he normally achieves. So from like the bodybuilding, business, anything he does, he, he sort of excels. So he's like a father figure to me as well as a mate. Relationships um, are like a good workout. You need to work hard, persistence, patience, and these two have been sparring for years. <laughs> but let's not forget the real reason we're here. Um, I've seen them overcome challenges, but jokes aside, their commitment to each other is inspiring. Just raise a glass to the power couple. Firstly, I want to say thank you to my husband for all your help leading up to this. Uh, meeting and sourcing all the suppliers, having meetings, finalising details. Oh, no, wait, that's my list. Here's yours. Buy a suit and arrive at 2pm. <laughs> Smashed it, babe. Nailed it. Smashed it. <laughs> but all jokes aside, thank you for making all of my dreams come true, not just today, but every day. And I'm happy to be sharing my life with you. 